What's up guys, John here, coming at you with episode 5 of Super Mario Maker Mechanics. Alright guys, today I want to talk about a glitch that uh, was brought to my attention by one of my viewers. Um, it's an anti-gravity glitch. What it allows you to do is essentially make items not fall and make them float instead. So the first thing you want to do is put a track across and add a musical note to it. Now once the musical note is on it, you can drag it and put it above the ground um, at the bottom. The next thing you want to do is either get a POW block or a P-switch or both, doesn't matter. Um, and make sure that they're on either side of the musical note above the ground. And then you don't want those to bounce up when the musical note travels underneath it, so you need to put something solid above it to keep them from bouncing up in the air. Um, another thing you want to worry about is that maybe someone might grab it in your level, so you want to make it so that the um, items are not able to be grabbed. Um, in order to do that, you want to put up like walls on the outside of it, so I just put up a couple little walls. Um, lastly, you want to make sure that they can't jump down there and grab it, so you, a lot of people use uh, donuts, and they just put it over top of the whole thing, that way you just bounce out if you try to go down and grab it. Um, after that, you've noticed I put a POW block out that I can drop into the machine. Um, so I'm going to hop up and drop it into the anti-gravity machine and it's going to be uh, shot back out with anti-gravity um, mechanics. Um, so a lot of people what they'll do is they'll add a roof so that uh, you can you know, throw it down there and not worry about it floating away to the sky. So I just add a little bit of a roof. Now what you'll notice is right here I grab the P-switch now and I accidentally activate it but it was a good thing because I wanted to show you guys what happens if you don't have an item on both sides um, the glitch does it doesn't work anymore it no longer works so it just you notice the power bar goes up goes back down like it's supposed to now um, the last thing I want to talk about is when you're making the glitch um, you want to make sure that you add the musical note onto the track before you pull it over the ground if you put the track down and pull the track down and then try to add a musical note to it it'll delete the ground which will not allow the glitch to work so you'll need to put the musical note on it and then pull it down underground uh, I decided I wanted to use the level of the person that brought this to my attention um, his code is down in the bottom left corner you guys should go in there and give him a star uh, and this is just going to showcase what you can use the anti-gravity machine for um, what you could use the glitch for and the first thing you notice is that a uh, POW block gets shot out of the cannon and it gets shot right into the anti-gravity glitch that's just so, so you know what it's used for um, and then I run and I slide and I drop the POW um, so that it floats across the ceiling hitting the musical note activating the cannon blowing up the bomb and releasing the P-switch now I use the P-switch to go back in there and I immediately drop it into the anti-gravity machine um, I go grab it and now if you try to use the P-switch outside the cannon will fall and block your way so there will be no way that you can get there but if you come underneath there and you kick it out it will go up and it will hit the floating th um, thwomp uh, and it will activate and you will be safe to go through the P-switch door thank you guys so much for all the support I can't say it enough you guys have been awesome and uh, I'll see you guys next time